Hey everybody, Eckers here. Welcome to the Long Dark Interloper. Alright, well... I had another not so good experience. Beyond, oh my god, negative 25 degrees. Where am I at? Am I? Where am I? Oh my god, is this is this Timberwolf again? Oh no, 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 this is Pleasant, pleasant Valley. Not so Pleasant Valley right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay, um, okay. Think, think, think. Where's the silo? Okay, I need to get over there. Too sweet. Jeez, how do I get off this freaking mountain? Oh, there's ropes. Okay, so that's apparently how I'm supposed to get down. My lord. That's a long way. I can't get back over there. Come on, let me get up there. Alright. We are just going to have to get off this freaking mountain. Alright, so. I died again. I started actually at desolation point and it was a pretty good spawn but I got attacked by a wolf and then I bled out because I didn't have any bandages and uh, yeah it was just pretty bad I tried tearing up some clothes but by the time I made it to the lighthouse where I could do that I was I was already like at 20% health and it just doesn't work that way all right oh is that a house that looks like a house all right, let's get there. Let's get there. I don't really know this area of Pleasant Valley that well. This side of the map. So, it seems like all my spawn points are just places that just kind of suck for me in general. Which is fine. It's fine. That's that's just the way they want to play the game. So that's the way I gotta play. So cold. Yeah, I, know, I hear you, brother. I hear you. I hear you. But no, we're not gonna be breaking any branches. Set up. Oh. Sorry, little jumpy. Those bunnies. I imagine those are just straight up vampire bunnies or something like that. Because this is interloper mode, so I'm imagining that the bunnies just absolutely tear into you. Alright. So I'm thinking for Pleasant Valley, we might be able to make it over to Mystery Lake, which might be pretty good. If we can get over there. If we'll make sure I'm not walking headlong into a pack of wolves. Oh gosh, got all kinds of mushroom stuff. So each one of these teas that I can make is 100 calories. So I think it's every three mushrooms you can make a cup of tea. I think that's what it is. Of course, interloper might be different. And there's some rose hips. I do believe it's the same for rose hips. Three rose hips makes a rose hip tea, which is good for, uh, I think it's pain, isn't it? I think it's a pain bed. All right, what's the temperature here? 31 degrees, not quite warm enough, but once we get into bed, it will be. All right, and we have a nice bed. Ooh, it's a 10 degree bed. That's nice, I like that. Anything under the bed? Of course not. Just a wolf. Come on, give me some clothes, man. Give me nice, nice, decent wool hat, I'll take it. I'll take it, because we don't even have a hat, so that's just straight up bonus right there. All right, yeah, what else? Can we do anything? Ooh, what's this? Ooh, 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 ooh. Sneaky candy bar. Love the sneaky candy bars. All right, um, it is time to get into bed and relax and warm up. Okay, so let's. Eleven hours of daylight left. Good, we got a lot of daylight left. Let's go ahead and sleep. And someone's pinging me, so I'm sorry I'm not responding to you, whoever you may be. But it's probably Willow West on Discord. Either that or Grifter. I'm not sure which. So are we warm yet? We're not really warm. Okay, let's go ahead and grab something to eat here. Wonderful. I wish I could just eat those. I don't know why you couldn't just eat them straight away, you know. Oh, let's put on the, the hat too. Well, that's good. Help a little bit. Every little bit helps. Let's go another three hours. Just to warm up fully. Like I'm not tired anyway. Oh. What is it? Feels like 32 in here. We need to get moving. Not fatigued enough and 32 degrees I will slowly freeze so if I'm gonna freeze I might as well be making a headway towards uh, or somewhere that will really help me I think that farmhouse I'd love to oh there's some old man's beard I missed that's okay so that farmhouse is gonna be really uh, helpful I think we can get to it and um, Desolation Point is pretty good because I think that's where the only place I'm going to be able to find a hammer. And I know that's the only place with the forge. Uh, 
And I need those in order to make makeshift uh, a makeshift knife. Uh oh, someone's going to hey. Come play with me. Can't feel my feet. I'm saying, hey, I'm just trying to survive longer than five minutes here, so. Alright, let's keep moving. Look both ways before you cross the frozen river. I think this is the river where I got attacked by the bear the first time. And uh, killed. Killed by the bear the first time. Except I think it was further down that way. Okay, okay, okay. Damn. I'm freezing. Alright, I'm pretty sure I need to go over this way to get to the... Uh, sure it's over this way to get to where the silo was and all that junk yeah I think this is like the back 40 all right let's go this way well I well we survived longer than I did in that worst spawn ever episode That's what I'm looking for right there. Ooh, there's some, there's some, these are either cattails or we just need to make a run for it. Honestly. Is there a wolf there? Oh yeah, of course there's freaking wolves. Wolves everywhere. Oh my god. Okay, okay. I'm gonna have to go this way, I think. And try to climb back up here best I can. I do not want to tangle with a wolf right now. Don't want to tangle with a wolf. Let's see if I can just get up here and get a better. Come on, get up here and get a better view of how I'm gonna to have to frogger my butt across this frozen tundra. All right, all right. So what I'm seeing is I, I take the, I stay down here in the channel, and then I pop my my little happy head up about 300 yards down down the river. And then, should be good to go. Alright, I think we can get some uh, sustenance here on the way as well, maybe. Uh, oh yeah, there's some cattails. I hesitate going for it because I don't know if the wolf can smell me from there. Oh man, I don't want to catch hypothermia. I'm not, I mean, I guess it's okay. Each of these is 150 calories, by the way. Plus we're getting some tinder as well. So, those are like huge when it comes to this early early game survival especially I imagine in this type of uh, difficulty setting all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. where are you I know you're over here somewhere let's run okay I think I go around this rock and then up and over I should be right about there so what does that sound I hear stuff running around up there frantically, which definitely does not inspire confidence in me popping my head up right about here, because this is an area where the bear does patrol on occasion. And I have discovered interloper. Yeah, bears still don't like you in interloper. Okay, good. Okay, what we got going on? What's going on out here? Let's move, let's move. Alright. Anything in here at all? Oh, I've always been ducking to get in there. I guess I never had to duck. What does that sound? There's something that either creaked or gurred at me. I'm not sure which. Was it a gur or was it a creak? Get inside, get inside, get inside. Get inside. Get, oh, jeez. Oh, these doors really should come with instruction manuals. Alright. 44 degrees in here. Oh, man, this is like... Oh, a little bit of heaven right here. Uh, I think I see some peaches here. Is this peaches? It is peaches. Hi, Peaches. I feel like I'm talking to, talking to 
do a stripper or something. All right, so we're not we're not having much luck at all here. What we got here? Wilderness kitchen. This will come in handy. Only guide you'll ever need to cooking on a campfire. I don't have a campfire. I have a stove. All right. So yeah, those of you that don't know, this sandbox mode, uh, the animals are more more aggressive. Uh, there are, is no rifle spawn in the game, so no rifles. Um. Oh, no uh, man-made weapons, like factory-made weapons, anything like that, except for, I think, the uh, hacksaw and the hammer. So there's not going to be any knives or hatchets laying around, which should make things very interesting. And I have to manage to craft that myself. And apparently the hammer and the hacksaw is pretty rare. So I don't know how I'm going to go about crafting that. I'll figure it out. I guess I just need to collect enough scrap metal. Yeah, I think that's all I need to do, right? I probably have to collect enough scrap metal and then have some cloth, I think it is. And then go on down to the... F do I go to the forge to make it? I think I do. I'll have to wiki it. But we're not there yet. We're just getting established, so I'll figure it out. Because I've never had to make a improvised knife or hatchet or whatever. Because I've always uh, just found tons of those laying around that never even crossed my mind. So it's, it's forcing me to sort of think differently here. Alright, we got some more food. That was good. And we still have the basement to check to the cellar. Uh, but uh, I am just kind of waiting to warm up here. Might take a little nap because I am a little winded. Uh, but let's head upstairs here. And see if we can find anything else of use. I picked up a hat, didn't I? It was another hat. Which one's better? Oh, this one's way better. Let's throw that on. Much better. We can tear that into cloth, then make that cloth into bandages, and then use the old man's beard with the bandages to make a, you know, like a sterile bandage. That'll help with infection. Ooh, a down ski jacket. Stuff will come in 82%. Here. Oh, I love you. Oh, my gosh. Put that on. That will come in handy. Man. Farmhouse. How I love thee. All right, so we got some drawers here. Sports socks will take it. If for nothing else than just the, the cloth. Of course you can tear up things for cloth now, so it's not that huge. Oh, yeah, I can grab water from here. Huh. I forgot, and there's a toilet downstairs too, so that's like a freaking gallon of water right there. Any, oh man, I was hoping we had some tub clothes. I love tub clothes, especially when they're jeans. Uh, oh, what do we got here? E, nothing. Okay, uh, didn't think I was going to have any luck with that. Plastic container. Probably just Legos. Okay, okay. Anything in here? Sewing kit. Oh, ooh, that will be nice. Alright, well. Nothing just laying about, so let's check the drawers here. Nothing. Okay. Oh, it's so nice and warm in here. I love it. I'm, not, I'm no longer freezing to death. Come on. And there's a cat. There's a, a wardrobe behind me. That'll come in handy. I have big hopes for this wardrobe. I'm hoping I just pull, you know, like a bear bedroll out of there. Maybe uh, wolfskin pants. and um, Hopefully this was the uh, farmhouse of an avid hunter. And they used all the hides and created clothes out of them. So let's see. Oh man, he wasn't that good of a hunter, was he? Alright. That's a 12.6 degree bed. That is awesome. Alright, so let's sleep for eight hours a day. Let's sleep for three. You know what? Let's not do that. Let's actually craft first. Um, tinder plug. Oh, I can make that branches. Um... What do I want to do? Oh, I guess I need to harvest first. Okay, so let's harvest that and those socks. Let's do that. All right, we'll harvest these socks here. This is 
is actually a really good spot to be in this at this point in this game because the water itself is just really helpful. I mean, without having a way to start a fire, that's that's huge. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and get a drink here. <sighs> Wonderful. Let's go ahead and eat. Might as well put the calories on board, right? I'll keep searching. Maybe I'll get a can opener downstairs and I won't have to smash it and lose a few calories. So I'm going to actually wait on that. Hopefully we get lucky and find a can opener downstairs in the basement. Uh, yeah, so we'll save that. And these... Might as well just eat two of these. We're going to be completely, like, pretty much completely topped up here with calories. 350. Yeah, I can eat one more. Perfect. All right. And did that make me thirsty? It did make me a little thirsty. So, honestly, interloper life right now is pretty good. No complaints. All right, so we tore those up. We have cloth. Let's go ahead and craft up a couple bandages. Definitely want to have two, if possible, here. And uh, let's do another one. Well, hold on. Let, let me take a look at my clothing, see if anything is in desperate need of being fixed. No, everything's pretty decent. Yeah, it's actually really decent. Wow. I feel very fortunate thus far. This is so much better than Timberwolf Mountain spawning. <laughs> Seriously, this is... Alright, I need a couple more of that old man's beards. Okay, so we'll have to keep our eyes open. That's priority. Because we need we do need some sort of a... You know, uh... If I missed anything. I don't look under these. Let's check if I make sure I didn't miss anything under these beds. Okay. Nope, yep, looks good. Alright. Let's head downstairs and grab some more water. Not worried about weight at the moment. Because we're only carrying 23 pounds. Uh, anything in here? Is there a chicken here? I think I did. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I checked in here. I'm just double checking. Yeah, alright. Nothing in here at all. Okay, let's go and grab that water from this toilet. And let's head on downstairs into the cellar. Next stop, I think, will be uh, Signal Hill, probably. And then we'll head on down to the barn, and we'll make our happy, we'll beat feet out of here and uh, try to make it over to Desolation Point, I would imagine. Let's see what the temp looks like out here. How, bad, how nasty is it? Oh, it's pretty freaking wicked. Wow. Whoa. Yeah, it's pretty wicked. Let's get out of here. Let's get out of that. 41 downstairs here, even. That's pretty good. Okay, well, if there is a chance that we can find a storm lantern here, this might be it. Hopefully we get real lucky with that. What is this? Oh, matches. Nice. I'll take it. I'll take it. Any of these open? Uh, nothing searchable here. Both of those I need a pry bar for. If you guys see a pry bar anywhere. It's more metal. We'll take it. What's this? Another educational book? What is that? No. Not sure what that is. Anything laying on the bork bench? I can't really see, so I'm sort of having to search with the cursor here. Nothing. Not a. Oh boy, okay. Oh, sometimes they're closing this in these. Oh man, the stingy bastards. It took all their clothes with them. Hmm. Not much going on down here. Yep. I don't think I missed anything. Well, at least we can start a fire now and make more water if we need to. That is a plus. Oh, what's this back here? What's this? What's this? Quality tools. We'll take it. Nice. All right. So, we have a blizzard set in. I'm thinking what we do 
is we sleep in the nice warm bed until the blister passes. We're pretty good on the calories, we're good on water, we just make sure we're in good shape, and we go for Signal Hill. So I think that's the game plan. I think that's the smart play. You know what? Wasn't there a, no, it's the tractor's on the other. The tractor's where the uh, barn is, isn't it? I was say that tractor typically always has, um, always has the uh, 44 in here still. Oh, I never checked the freezer or the freezer. I'm sure there's nothing in here. I'd be shocked if there's like a rabbit in here. All right, anyway, that was worth a shot. Yeah, the tractor typically has a soda in there. I don't know if that's true in interlope or not. All right, well, I'm just paranoid about missing something because things are so rare in this particular. Can I sit here? Oh, I need a hatchet. That's for breaking it down, okay. Well, let's go ahead and rest up here for a few hours. Hopefully storm, storm passes sooner rather than later. Okay. And uh, we can get on the move here. go well I am not gonna play any more of this until I release this first video I'm just gonna I'm gonna take this one video at a time it might make the series a little bit longer like you know I'm not gonna be able to release five episodes back to back to back to back day after day because of my work schedule basically but I think this way when you guys give me some feedback I'll be able to directly implement it into this game I think in this series I really do need all the help I can get from you guys in the comments. Uh, suggestions and things like that. Um, if you hear me start thinking about going down a certain route, you're like, no, I, don't, I wouldn't do that. Please let me know. Give me your reasoning. Um, still a blizzard's going on. And it looks like it's starting to get to be dark. So I think we're going to be here for the night, for the duration, unfortunately. And uh, all right, we'll just go ahead and end it here. I know it's a little early, but uh, that's okay. I'm sure we'll spill over and have some games that run a little bit late. But uh, yeah, if you haven't already and you're new to the channel, like, comment, subscribe. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next episode after I read all your comments. So y'all take care. Thank you so much for watching. See you in the next one.